Hey everybody, today I'll be showing you how to sync your Arrows Loop Studio pedal with Ableton Live. I'll be sending the MIDI clock from Ableton to the Arrows so that I can sync the BPM and have quantized loops in Ableton. To set this up, you just need a standard 5-pin MIDI cable going from the MIDI out of your interface into MIDI in on the Arrows. So now let's go into Ableton and change some settings. So go into Ableton's preferences and under Link MIDI, you want to make sure that all of these are turned on. The next thing you want to do is find a BPM for your loop. I've already set mine at 109. So now let's go into the arrows and make sure we have everything set up there. First go into the arrows settings and scroll down to the MIDI settings. We want to make sure that the MIDI in is either set to record or playback. This means when you hit play in Ableton, the arrows will either start recording or just start playing. So I like to set that as playback and then I can use the arrows foot switch to punch in when I'm ready to loop. The MIDI in channel defaults to all and that can stay as is. So now let's set up our song. Under song settings, I like to sync the start and length of each loop and have the quantize to measure feature turned on. This means that when you punch in, the arrows will automatically start looping on the downbeat of the next measure, and when you punch out, it will also end on the downbeat. Just make sure that the time signature and the tempo matches what's going on in your Ableton session. I read in the manual of the arrows that if that's not set up, it can throw some things off. Okay, so notice on the arrow screen, the MIDI sync says off right now, but as soon as I hit play in Ableton, the arrow starts playing also. Now that only works if you hit play at the very beginning of your session. If I were to maybe go over two measures and hit play, the arrows won't automatically start playing, but the MIDI sync has now turned on. So something that's really cool about having your arrows synced with Ableton is that you can use Ableton to kind of structure your performances and add in certain layers that you have previously recorded. So I've set up a performance where I know that once I hit play in Ableton, I'll have two measures of count in and then I can start my loop and then I've lined up the drums for where I want those to come in. So I'll end with a quick performance using the Arrows Loop Studio and Ableton Live.